Olympic Hall is undergoing a huge renovation, and in the process, construction crews found human remains buried under the building. Not on your sides, Brianna Harper explains who is now collecting the bones and what they'll do with them. I'm standing here at the corner of Elm and 14th Street at what used to be the site of two church cemeteries. But now that piece of Cincinnati history is reemerging hundreds of years later. It's always about reinvention. You know, that's one thing that the city's been really good at. Music Hall is getting a facelift. Construction is well underway, and when crews moved into the orchestra pit, they uncovered human remains buried in a grave. A lot of those cemeteries were quite full, uh, and in some cases quite neglected. So this cemetery was like a lot of others, and it wasn't terribly unique that they chose to, to move it and build on that same location. Historians at the Cincinnati Museum say when construction first began at Singerfest Hall back in the 1860s, the goal was to have all the buried remains moved, but some were missed. Now, the records and things for those burials aren't always the best. And so in some cases, you're going to find multiple individuals. This isn't the first time the past has come back. In 2010, when Washington Park was being developed, reports of skeleton bones surfaced. The city says it has a plan to preserve the bones recently found. Some cases, they have left the remains on the site. In other cases, they have reinterred them at Spring Grove Cemetery, which is where uh, the burials were removed when they uh, constructed the building in 1877 and 78. Once the remains are relocated, the hope is that further analysis will reveal more about the lives of the people who were buried under Cincinnati's Music Hall. Brianna Harper reporting 9 on your side.